This is beautiful Jerusalem, the very first night of the Holy Land tour with our man of God. While it has been a day packed of events, delegates arriving from all over the world. Well, this is it. We're here again in Israel. And what makes it really special is not just coming to Israel, which is very special, but being here with Pastor Chris. And this is the second time, and I'm so grateful to God for that. freshen up and do what we do best hear the word from a man of God live and direct right there where it happened in the Bible days so I'm excited oh my goodness can you see the board right there yeah oh PK is in the land oh Jesus hallelujah Feel it. Oh. and of course right now the first official dinner of the Holy Land tour 2016 with our man of God Clearly, as you can see right behind me, these are all the delegates that arrived this morning and even this afternoon from different parts of the world, gathered here together for this historical moment as we remember our Saviour Christ in the Holy Land. Thank you very much. Okay, so which, where are you coming from? I, I came from Tonga, Australia, and she's from PG. We came from the Pacific. So um, it was a long trip, but we are so glad that we are here. My expectation, I, I look forward to come to Israel. Number one, because I know there is so much I can gain just by walking in the land where Jesus walked, where Abraham walked, where all the great men of God walked. And I, I, I know that even though I read in the Bible and I hear it, there's so much more that God can impart to me in my own personal uh, feelings and experience that will be far deeper. Even though uh, I've got so much. So one of the greatest opportunities here like tonight, for him to recognize me. I'm so touched. I'm so honored. And just think that God took me, I used to think of nobody, to make me somebody. No wonder, Pastor Chris, you give my life a meaning. I would like to say thank you so much to Pastor Chris for the bringing me here to the Holy Land tour with you. Um, experience so many things and see many things to which I can never imagine that I will see in my eyes. From the first day I come here until today, all things are amazing, amazing, and it impacts my spirit where sometimes tears falling down. Sometimes it make me so happy, sometimes it encourage me. And today the, what I want to say, one of the things is that I see all the beautiful things, all amazing things, all the Bible which we already read in the, the things that, that which I see them in my eyes. It's so much. But beyond that, something that I learned here is that pastors, you have teaching us the word of God so deeply and that impacts me, my spirit. Um, I always have in my mind that a woman like me, a lady like me, come from nowhere and experience all these things by the power of God. And I know that I 
thank my God for the knowing Him and uh, having Him for my Savior and Lord. When I see them, the Jews, they are the people of the Bible, but they don't know Him. But for me, a, a lady like me, experience of the glorious things in my life is words cannot be expressed. And I say thank you, Lord for saving my soul and make me who I am today. A lady like me to come in contact with this kind of anointing and message. Lord, help me to do. I will go back and I will not let anyone pass by me without knowing this. The message you have given me, the love you have given me to give them and show them that as long as I live here, help me to do the best way, the best way to do. And that's why my prayer. And thank you, Pastor. Thank you so much. I'm so much inside me. I, my work cannot express, but I want to say you thank you, and I love you so much. Thank you. Um, this is my first time here in Israel, never been here before. But I have already read a lot of things about Israel in the Bible and uh, Old Testament. So I was very excited to come to Israel and to see those places where many, many things happened and where our Lord Jesus Christ uh, walked and did miracles. And my expectation was that I will hear something, something special from God to the near future. And I can tell you that my expectation has been fulfilled because I got a lot of things here from the Lord uh, through Pastor Chris and through the guide, tour, tour guide, and through those places where we has been. We have we visited the many, many places during the last eight days, and I that tour was the tour is more than a, a mere tour. It was, as Pastor Chris said, that was a school. And my favorite saying was that Israel is, a, is, is the Bible in 3D. almost like sitting or looking at an old Roman ruin, only this time it's in Israel. Uh, but we've been told by a guy that this is actually uh, an old city built by pagans, not the Jews or the, uh, or, or the Christians of the Byzantine period, but rather by the Romans themselves that actually call this home. Um, it's really very beautiful to see how preserved a lot of these things have been. We've seen some of the colonnades, we've seen some of the mosaic floors, we've seen so much of it preserved. It's almost frozen in time. Uh, we even got to see some of the public toiletries. It's really interesting. Um, it was well organized. We saw some drainages on the roads, and one would never have thought that a society so old would have had such sophistication. Altogether, for me, it's been an experience um, that I truly cannot put in words. Um, pastor has just been great. In fact, lectures with Pastor, even at the, at the garden tone, was most exhilarating. It, it showed a lot of insight into some things that we thought we knew, but we got to relearn them only in a simpler way. I, I was particularly very blessed by the messages. It, it confirmed a lot of things that we believed over the years, but now one could put pictures to the things we've always known. And it, it's just been great. It's really just been great. This is, of course, my second time coming here, and this is far better than the first. We've seen a lot more, we've had more time with Pastor, and it's just been real. You can travel all over the world, of course, if you can afford it on your own to various sites, even here. But there is no comparison when you have to come here. When you come here with Pastor Chris, you, you don't only learn what you're looking at again, but you, you get the explanation of every part, of every 
every single historical figurine that you come across. You, you get to know what they represent and it balances everything you've always known. It's been great, it's, it's just been fabulous. I'm looking forward to uh, more sites. Uh, we've been out, so you can hear my voice. It's been very exciting, we've been screaming yesterday. We had the, the Shabbat dinner, a lot of us were jumping around and, and screaming and just having a wonderful time here. You know, I, think, I, th I really thank God for the privilege I thank Pastor for, for being conscientious enough to believe that we needed to come here so we can see what we know. Now we have the pictures to basically add to our conviction. It makes it perfect, it makes it complete. Again, this is Dr. Ken. Thank you so much, Pastor. Love you.